Surely you understand, it'll never be enough. You have to ask yourself, when you finally get the ultimate promotion, when you've made the ultimate purchase and climbed the ladder of success to the highest rung you can possibly climb it, and the thrill wears off, and it will wear off, then what? How far do you have to walk down that road before you see where it leads? So you have to ask yourself the question, what matters? What you are seeing is a Soviet paratrooper belonging to the 345th Independent Guard Airborne Regiment between 1987 and 1988 during the Soviet invasion of Afghanistan. During this time, this particular unit was one of many regiments and divisions to participate in perhaps one of the most crucial operations during the Soviet-Afghan War, Operation Magistral. Today, I will be giving you a brief history of this impression, as well as a rundown of the particular setup I am running. I hope you will enjoy. In December 1979, special forces from the Soviet Union's KGB, GRU, and VDV units raided the palace of President Hafizullah Amin, the president of Afghanistan at the time, in order to terminate him and stage new socialist leaders in Afghanistan's government. The removal of President Amin would eventually lead to the rest of the invasion of Afghanistan, which lasted from 1979 to 1989. This was to further Soviet influence over NATO, help ease fears of growing tension over Islamic extremism, and to solve some potential economic crises that were erupting in the Soviet Union. As a result of this invasion, an Afghan Islamic militant organization known as the Mujahideen, which roughly translates to Holy Warrior, fought the Soviet forces using conventional guerrilla warfare tactics. Despite the Soviets having more sophisticated technology than the jihadists, it proved that no superpower can conquer Afghanistan when the Soviet Union withdrew from the country in 1989. It was said by Mujahideen forces that killing a communist was equivalent to praying to Allah 80,000 times. In 2005, Russian film director Fedor Bandarchuk released Nine Roto, or Ninth Company in English, a film that has become increasingly popular in the West, depicting the Ninth Company of the 345th Independent Guards Airborne Regiment's journey from basic training up until their deployment in Afghanistan in 1987. It is safe to say that some of you may have become interested in building an impression based on this film, but before that, I'll briefly go over Operation Magistral and the Battle of Hill 3234 which are the events portrayed in the 9th Company film. Operation Magistral, a Soviet operation that began in the fall of 1987, was a plan conducted to seize a Mujahideen-controlled road between the cities of Gardez and Kost, which housed a large population and Afghan national troops that were in need of ammunition and humanitarian aid to fight the Mujahideen. Kost also contained an airbase just three kilometers outside the city that primarily conducted helicopter operations. During this operation, the 9th Company of the 345th Independent Guards Airborne Regiment were sent to a mountain peak that looked over the highway between Gardez and Coast with an elevation of 3,234 meters, which then was given the name Hill 3234. For two days, the paratroopers successfully defended the mountain from an onslaught of about 300 Mujahideen, while the 9th Company only consisted of 39 men. 